In this tutorial, I'll be telling you how to edit your startup, your Windows startup, and services to make your computer run faster. I'm going to tell you how to get rid of all that junk that starts on startup that you don't want. The first thing you have to do is go to the bottom left corner of your screen, go to Start, Run, or click Windows Key R, and it's going to pop up this dialog box, and type msconfig. Click Enter or OK going to bring up this system configuration utility. Now we have, uh, go to your startup tab, it's going to start here, just click startup, and it's going to tell you all the programs that want to start on startup. Uncheck any of the ones you don't want. To see which ones you do and don't want, check the command, see what program it is. If you do not recognize a program, go to the location, see if that helps any. For example, this is Microsoft Windows, so I'm not going to mess with it right now. <coughs> and uh, if you're unsure, for example, this is smc.execute. I don't know what that program is or something. Now let's just go to Google real quick. And we search Sygate smc.execute. And the first thing it gives us is, what is this process? Well, it's a firewall from Sygate, and it gives you more if you click the links. So if you're unsure about any of the programs, uh, be sure to check them. But you really should go through each and every one of these guys to make sure you know what's starting up. Next we're going to go to the Services tab. Now the Services tab can make a mess if you screw up on this thing, but it won't be that um, risky if you order by manufacturer. Obviously you don't want to mess too much with the ones made by Microsoft. Mess with the ones that are from unknown manufacturer. And make sure you don't have a ton of unknown manufacturers uh, on your startup Windows services. If you're unsure about any of these, again, just go to Google and uh, search their name, paste it, and see what it does. Now another way to do this is, again, click apply changes first and click OK it's going to prompt you do you want to restart right now click uh, exit without restart so you don't have to restart your computer just yet and click start run again and type services.msc this opens a program here that lists all the Windows services and it'll give you a brief description of what each of these do if you want to uh, remove some of the Windows one because many I'm sure you do not use like maybe the themes one now to close your currently running programs click control delete and it'll give you a list of currently running programs in process and applications now this is useful, but uh, I prefer processes because it will give me the list. Sometimes you have to click Task Manager first, depending on your XP version. And it's best to order by CPU and it will tell you what's using the most resources. The system idle process means that these root resources are not in use. For example here, the Task Manager and the Screen Recorder are the ones using up the most CPU space. So if your computer starts freezing, please, please, please don't shut it down or restart it. Just close the application that's taking up all the memory uh, or all the CPU usage.